Hello everybody, Mr. Storm here. Welcome back to Anno 1800. In the last episode, we got our new rigid airship hangar built in the new world. Uh, we're expanding the number of engineers in Cape Trelawney and making sure that they get supply with what they need. We needed to get some rubber for the penny farthings that they're going to want, so we worked on that. Uh, we had a little bit of a rum shortage, which should be resolved. So, there's that. And right as I started up... Um, we're having a riot here in Cape Trelawney. That's unfortunate. That's because of all the propaganda that we've been doing. <laughs> oh, we also got coffee. Um, and that sh should be set up. Yes, and this needs to be moved to Crown Fall Supplies, because that's what that is. So should this. And so should this. All right, so what I've done is, because we didn't have any police stations out here, I've gone ahead and dropped them in. So they should be responding here momentarily, and this will get resolved. So that's good. We've gotten some deliveries of oil, so we should be able to fuel our power. We're working on it. The rubber should be coming through. A tiny something to keep you going. Thanks. We've really got to deal with our deficit problem. Like, this really needs to get dealt with. Um... I'm trying to find out where the ship is. There's the rum ship. Fish and steel. Or did I use an airship for that? What was on that? It is an airship, the Electra. I don't think it's arrived from the New World yet. That most likely is what's happening. There it is. Yeah. Okay. Ultimately, what I would do, like to do, is replace everything, all the clippers, with either cargo ships. Or with airships. I could build cargo ships now. They're expensive to upkeep, though. So we need to deal with those costs. Getting penny farthings through will significantly help. If we can get uh, pocket watches being produced, that would also significantly help. So... Pocket Watches is the next project, I would think. And then we just need to get lots and lots of engineers. So, that is what we're going to do. We still have the rioting. We just mobilize some more... Uh, yeah, just, just just mobilize some more response forces and deal with that. All right, so we need to get tourists in here too. Uh, we'll worry about that here in a minute. Pocket watches. We need gold. Competitors have agreed a peace deal. Is Anne on her way back? No, I think we just destroyed 
Yeah, Jean should be on his way back here soon. I... What are you doing over here? Okay. We're gonna need gold. Now, let's see. We have gold in the Arctic, I believe. We have better gold Your mines there. Are safe again. Good. Do we have gold mines here? We do not have gold mines here. We have no gold mines here. Is gold even a thing? We have gold mines here in the New World. We have an airship that could carry it. This is true. Let's just go to the Arctic, because I did colonize an island over here specifically that has a couple of high-capacity gold deposits. What do they need? 100 technicians. That is not going to happen. Not here. There is a gold mine here. That could happen. How much how many technicians does it take to build So that could work. It would need some heat. That would be the only issue. Let's take advantage of the ones in the new world first. Let's take advantage of these. Because it's going to be much easier to deal with. Um, Requires 100. Uh, Obreras. Per mine. Okay. Well, if we supplied them with bombins, for example, we could get more of them per unit. They want a boxing arena. I think we could do that. Indeed, we could absolutely do that. Drop that in right away. They want some beer. Ooh. I'm proud of how far we've come. That's a happiness thing, and it would only provide a moderate increase in overall revenue. So... I think Bumbins. What do we need for Bumbins? We need alpaca farms. We have that. We need cotton plantations. We have that. We need cotton mills. We need felt In the producers. Old days, my voice would not have been heard. All right, let's see what we can do. That should be relatively simple to actually set up. Um, where? Where? Oh, 
over here is what we'll do. All right. We'll drop the warehouse in here. We will drop the Bumbin Weaver right there. Uh, we're going to need a couple of felt producer. Well, stand aside, boss. We need one. I can teach you how it works. You only need one of those for now. Now, demand on our cotton production. Um, I don't know. It's actual cotton mills that have demands, and we need to make sure that that, yeah. This is our only source of cotton. So we would need more. We would need lots more. Now what about our alpaca farms? We're actually good for alpaca farms. Uh, let's see. Let's we need some farmland. One thing I won't have to explain is gravity. Bombs, mines, pamphlets, care packages. Load up your airships and let them rain down. This building a supply factory. Hair packages is a new world supply factory. We'll get there. We'll get there. Okay. I just need a place where I can run some farms. Or we need to increase the productivity of the existing farms. That's probably more along the lines of what it is that we're actually going to do. Okay. For one thing, let's delete that. Let's see if we can make these a little bit more compact. All right. Same thing here. Delete all of that. Make that more compact. Let's move you over. Okay. Let's destroy that. Let's copy and paste that. Let's destroy that. Copy, paste that. Okay, good. Now, what it is we're going to do is... I'm, I'm aware, you've, you've told me this. A couple more of those. All right. Will that satisfy demand across all islands? That will satisfy demand across all islands. Uh, will we be able to satisfy demand for the actual cotton? We will. And we have additional capacity now. Are we producing enough fertilizer to cover all of that? We are. Or we can. But we are not getting enough dung. 
through. Is that the result of an issue with a warehouse, or is... We've got lots of dung and storage. We've got lots of fertilizer and storage. I think we're fine. I think we're fine on those fronts for the time being. All right, good. Now we have our workforce that we are going to need. That's good. Now you're gonna want some sewing machines. We're not gonna worry about your sewing machines right now. Cigars. We apparently have some cigars in stock. A little bit, but we're not producing them. We don't have tobacco fertility on this island. We have tobacco fertility on this island. So, if we were going to make cigars, they would go over there. And that's a happiness. That's a pretty decent coin return, and we might think about it. But right now, the objective is gold. All right. One gold mine is what we have. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna modify this to say load, load gold and unload gold accepts. That's a bauxite deposit. That's another gold deposit. So we could get a second one. Maybe. Let's go back to Cape Trelawney, and there's that stupid noise again that I have no understanding of why that does Ship that. Under attack. I figured that was going to happen soon. We've rebuilt before. We can do it again. Enemy target established. It looks like we did pretty well. All right. I've tried everything with you. Back here. Lucky watches. Lucky watches. There we are. We've taken to wearing hard hats here. All right, so... If we go back to the new world, back to our gold mine, Total demand. Oh, that just produces gold ore. We have nothing that's actually... Oh, we need to smelt it. I see. Um, the people celebrate your leadership. Did it again. Very annoying. A goldsmith's. Okay. A goldsmith's.
So what we actually want to do is with this guy, and we don't want to do that. We want to do this. There we go. The goldsmiths takes coal and gold ore. Okay. And now we can go back to the new world and say you total demand. Why are you not producing anything? Current potential is zero. Why? Can we not store gold ore in a warehouse? Does it need to be upgraded? I'm just a tad confused. Seductive charts bury my death. No thank you right now. No, there's Goldor. Okay. Why are you showing zero production potential? Maybe because it's significantly less than one. Ah. Oh. Then we would need that Arctic gold mine. Like, we would have to have this. Okay, um, <laughs> it is uh, not. We are actually producing enough to cover. And get a heater out here. Alright, and get a warehouse out here. But why are we even here, in fact? A technician transfers theory to practice. And that produces one. One gold ore. Crown Falls is demanding two. 
No, the question is, do we actually need that to? The formula is incomplete. It's all prepared. Yeah, we kind of do, don't we? We will all be absolutely behind you. Anything else? Then I'll send it out. Yep. Is everyone really as happy as you said? Keep the propaganda up. It's the only thing that's... I see you have little reverence. Kind of keeping things okay right now. Uh, what about our coal? Um... It's a surprise inspection. Coal mine? That's an iron mine. That's an iron mine. Uh, coal mine. Coal... Coal mine? Oh mine. We're fine uh, for coal. Good. Um. Electricity is essential. Why is there no fuel here? We have fuel. Are all of our trains busy or something? Did all of our trains go to deliver fuel? Good grief, guys. That's, uh... That's not great. Okay, then. We are going to need that second gold mine. Which means we are going to need to Ooh, good. upgrade just a ten. That works. You are a true revolutionary. Now uh, that means they're gonna put, be putting additional demands on things like ponchos. You should go sit in the shade, boss. Plantains. We're good. Uh, tortillas. Of course, come join us. Plenty. Coffee. That should be fine. Yep. All right, let's build it. Wait, that's a bauxite mine. That is not what I wanted to build. <laughs> I gave him a wrong mine. That's the mine that I want to build. There we go. Now we're producing one of one. Not quite covering it, but it should be enough. It should be enough to get that goldsmiths to make enough gold to make enough pocket watches for us to satisfy the demand. The other thing that we're going to need to make sure that we're doing okay with is glass. Wrong. Wrong map. There we are. I had better leave it to set. And we're fine for glass. Good deal. Now we need a way to get the gold from the New World. Or from the Arctic. We should have... This. That's an airship. And is that... That's connected there... 
Perfect. Bring some gold ore through next time you make that trip. Hey, we got some uh, some rubber through, some latex. Excellent. How much? A fair bit. My mother. Had... That means we should be producing penny farthings. I see new floor. Yep, which means we're satisfying that. We just need to get some pocket watches made. Now, here's the other thing, is if we could make significant quantities of pocket watches that we don't use, we could take them to Mbesa and sell them for pure, well not pure, but for significantly higher profit. A scattering of blossom. But let's just satisfy our needs first. Three thousand engineers. Oh, my goodness. All right. What we're going to try and do here now, I think, while we're waiting for all that stuff to come through, because it, it will eventually is we are going to need I want to try and set up the tourism uh where do we want them to come through Over here? These fabled lands exist after all. Hold off on that. Now, we want to upgrade that to a tourist mooring. Perfect. And then... We'd want to build a museum. Um... Botanical garden would be a good idea. But we need to get that uh, hotel first. We need to get some bus stops. Like uh, a bus stop, right? And a hotel. We can build that over here. Hmm, excuse me. Yeah, drop in the hotel. A pita tear at last. Breakfast at nine, I assume. Transportation means travel. Travel means adventure. Onward. 
Can you feel it? The push and pull of the city. Such wonders. Into the fray, then. All right. Tourists are going to want stuff. And I'm hoping that they will eventually pay me money. That would be great. We're going to want to get, like, our botanical gardens and stuff over here. And our museum. Kind of create this as the little tourist area. But we will work some more on that later. But for now, we'll go ahead and stop here. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead and like, subscribe, and comment. And I will see you next time.